Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check your keyboard history on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now there are a couple different options you have. Let's just open up a web browser here and I'm just going to go to a random website and let's say I tapped and hold and hit copy. And if you wanted to check what that history is, your iPhone basically keeps the history for only one copy. So I can tap and hold and hit paste. And you'll be able to see that it pastes in Sony, the exact word that I just copied. So essentially that is the only history that your keyboard keeps with the copy and paste. But there are some other things that it does remember. Let's open up the settings app here and we'll scroll down and tap on general. Now that we're on here, you can see keyboard right under date and time. Let's tap on it. And you'll see at the very top is keyboards. I can tap on that. I have both English and US. Now, of course, you can change these and change what keyboard you have associated with your phone. But you can also tap on text replacement. And all of these basically are where your phone will replace certain text with other text on here. If you don't want any of these on here, you can always just swipe to the left and hit delete if you don't want that to be on and auto correct on your keyboard. Now you can also go through here and toggle any of these on or off, but if you wanted to completely reset that keyboard history, you can go back here, tap on the transfer or reset iPhone, tap on the reset button, and then you can see reset keyboard dictionary here. Just enter in the password for your phone and it will completely wipe out your keyboard, any of that history, anything that it remembers, any of those replacements, the keyboard, the copy, all that stuff will completely be gone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.